All right, crew, thanks for joining me today. Today we're going to be looking at the Radeon Pro 7. This is different than the Radeon 7, as that's a gaming card. The Radeon Pro 7 is marketed towards workstation uh, computers and thus, you know, workstation type pieces of software like SolidWorks and Visualize and so on. So today we're going to check it out in SolidWorks and just see how it does. Cool, let's take a look. Today we're going to take a look at this uh, CAD file with the new Radeon Pro 7 GPU from AMD. I uh, just wanted to give it a test. Uh, have had um, difficulty rotating this part with um, lesser GPUs. Really wanted to see if I could tax this Radeon Pro 7 um, with this particular model. Uh, keep in mind this is on lightweight right now. I'm going to do this in lightweight mode and then we'll try it resolved. So you can see with some rotates and some in and out, uh, let's see, I'm getting about, what, 30% maybe uh, load on the GPU, 34%. Keep in mind, I have recording software running um, SolidWorks and amongst other applications. So it's not entirely all just SolidWorks that's, that's uh, being utilized here, but it um, looks pretty great right now. There's about 12 to 1300 parts in this assembly, and uh, I think it's handling it uh, very well, it pegs us a little bit higher. Yep, so we get up to about 80%, 84% when we change the display mode to show tangent edges. Um, one thing I wanted to mention though was that, you know, tubes, uh, tube structures are pretty difficult because there's graphics triangles on the outside and on the inside, so there's just a ton of graphics triangles in this file. Um, so now that it's resolved, we'll go ahead and rotate this and see if there's anything different. Um, let's see, a little less actually. We're going at 74, 80 uh, percent. Yeah, looks looks like it's handling this file like a champ. Uh, keep in mind, if you change your display state or display style too, rather, you know, you, you inundate your GPU differently, right? So it's a, a good hack if you're uh, if you're uh, suffering with performance. Just go ahead and take the uh, the shaded edges off and without shaded edges on. All right, so I wanted to share some final thoughts with you about this graphics card. The Radeon Pro 7 is a beast, without a doubt, and it's definitely AMD's flagship workstation GPU. And just remember, it's different than the Radeon 7, I know this can get confusing, but the Radeon Pro 7 designates that it's the workstation style GPU, and thus certified for SOLIDWORKS. So one of the things that I think I was able to compare to was the difference between the 4000, the 5000, and then say where the Radeon Pro sits, and then the, as far as like cost goes. So the, the competitors to this would be like an RTX 4000, which runs about $800. That would definitely be on the lesser end of the spectrum. And then we're looking at the RTX 5000, which is priced about the same, but really when you're looking at the hardware specs of the GPUs, the Radeon Pro 7 is far better, right? Just, just based off of RAM, um, throughput on RAM, uh, processing power and speed. Like it's, it's a higher grade piece of hardware. So then where would I put it as far as the lineup goes? And I, I was really considering it and, and thinking about this, but when, when, when looking at the specs online for, for an RTX A6000, I don't feel like it quite meets an A6000, but it's definitely better than an RTX 5000. So if you're looking for, uh, you know, uh, superior uh, graphics cards over, over RTX 5000 and you wanna jump above that, but not necessarily spring all the cash for the RTX 6000, then the Radeon Pro 7 is really right where you're fitting right there. You get 25% more hardware for roughly about the same amount of cost when compared to the RTX 5000. Uh, as far as SolidWorks goes, runs like a champ. Definitely can't complain. Visualize 2 using, not, uh, using the uh, AMD Render Pro uh, option. Uh, you know, again, runs like a champ, can't complain. Uh, I think this this GPU and this quality of GPU will make any SOLIDWORKS user happy. And it's also really suited for those folks who like to multitask. So if you're if you're running SOLIDWORKS and visualize and recording software and yada, 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 and you got all these things going with multiple screens, then, you know, the Radeon Pro 7 is right there up in your alley. Another thing that's really cool about the Radeon Pro 7 is that it has six uh, input slots or output slots rather for for monitors so you can stack a bunch of monitors on this one GPU whereas on the RTX 4000 and 5000 you're limited to four monitors 
So that's my conclusion on the Radeon Pro 7. Excellent GPU, great bang for the buck, like AMD always is. And, uh, you know, you'll be happy with it. Hey, if you watch this video all the way through, I, I want to thank you very much, first of all. And then second of all, if you could hit that like and subscribe button, I would greatly appreciate it. It helps me make more content for you, and it helps, I mean, it's motivating for me to do so. So, yep, I appreciate your input and your comments. I read them all. I try to reply where possible. And, hey, thanks for watching. Fight on.